Hey everybody! I'm here today to show you how to crack your shoulders by yourself. This is a very easy process and if you want to self-adjust for your shoulders for pain relief at home, you can definitely use these two methods. Let's get right into the video. First and foremost, I'm going to show you how to set it up for the first movement, which is the harder of the two. Then I'm going to show you what to do and then I'll show you the second movement, which is a little bit easier to do, okay? Now you might hear some pops and cracks when you do this and that is just likely going to be the gases escaping from your shoulders, which will hopefully give you some pain relief um, and it's it's a pretty natural thing to happen a pretty natural thing to do all right so first and foremost you want to get the shoulder that you want to relieve the pain in or that you want to sort of crack um, and you want to basically bring your arm out like this okay as you can see once again bring your arm out like this like almost like your hand on your hip kind of idea okay then you want to get your other hand you want to place it on the shoulder just to give it a little bit of stabilization okay because your shoulders are rounded so you need an extra form of support like this you have one form and you have an extra form right here okay then you're gonna go up against something that gives you resistance so I'm using the side of this door frame here you can use anything it can be the edge of a wall it doesn't matter Okay, but what you're going to do is you're going to basically, as you can see, my, my hand is like this. Okay, just to be clear, not like this. My hand is like this. Okay, what you're going to do, so your thumb is towards the back over here. What you're going to do is you're going to sort of push back like that. Push the elbow back. And you're going to do it against resistance. By doing that, you're sort of allowing the shoulder to move forward a bit, which should give you a little bit of a pop or a little bit of a pain relief. So check this out. I'm against a door frame. I got my hand for support. I, let's just see if we can crack my shoulders. I did them recently, so I don't know if we're going to get anything. But this is the method, okay? Oh, there you go. I don't know if you heard that pop, but it just went pop. So I just cracked that one. Same thing with the other one. Okay, we should probably be able to get a pop out of this one too, although my right shoulder cracks more than my left. We're going to try and get one over here too, so just listen closely. No, nope, we'll try one more time. Just get a little bit of a better angle right here. No, nope. okay, so no problem. Try it a few times, like, you know, you can keep trying. If it's not going to pop, it's not going to pop. You're not forcing it. Try a couple times, it's either going to pop or it's not going to pop, okay? Um, and the second movement is really easy. Um, this is a movement that, you know, I almost always get a, a pop from, almost get a, a, almost always get a crack from, except uh, I already cracked my shoulder on this side, so we might only hear one. What you're going to do, reach behind you like this, okay? Interlock your hands like that, and you're going to stretch back, but at the same time, you're going to pull your shoulders back. So you're stretching your arms back, but not like this. At the same time, you're pulling your shoulders back simultaneously, just like this, okay? Okay. One more time we're going to try. All right. So that's basically it. Now, the great thing about these movements is that even if you don't crack your shoulders or even if you don't hear a pop like that, you're still going to get some pain relief because you're stretching them nicely. Now, remember, you're not going past your comfort zone. When I was doing that, I wasn't pushing to the point where I was like, ah, ah, it hurts. No, not at all. Okay. Very simple. Wasn't doing that at all. Just a little bit of a, just a little attempt. Okay. That's it. It's either going to work or it's not going to work. But either way, you should experience some pain relief. But if your shoulders want to pop or want to crack, then this should help you sort of crack your shoulders like that and adjust at home, self-adjust at home. Because you can see I'm doing this without anyone or anything else. It's just using regular things that you have um, in any building that you're going to be in. And that's basically it. I really hope that you've enjoyed this video. If you liked it, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.